Hello, Macy here. Spirit Wolf have detected a spy satellite sneakily placed in geosynchronous orbit over KSC. Um, someone's obviously been spying on the new Isprit um, test flights. We cannot have this. This cannot be allowed. So I think this is a perfect opportunity to test the Havoc missile's effectiveness in the field and also demonstrate to our rivals that Spirit Wolf will not be messed with. We're going to have to make sure that this sinister eye in the heavens is going to be closed forever. I still haven't finalised the designs for the carrier I intend for this. So for now I'm just going to use a simple rocket array to get it into orbit. This is my mission brief. So I need to try and make orbit and find this spy satellite and take it out. I've only got one shot because I've got two missiles linked on the wings here so I've got one shot at this. So I want to get nice and close to the target and hit it somewhere sensitive but hard and see if I can take it out. I'm not sure if it's got the power but we'll see. So I'm just making an orbit here in the regular way. Um, just dumped my first stage there. It's just enough to make low orbit and then I'll drop what's left and um, the rest will be under its own power. I am designing a carrier at the moment but it's very hard to make a carrier I'm not sure if any of you have tried but it's extremely hard to make an effective single stage carrier it's sucking up a lot of time but I will get it so I've just pushed the fast item orbit out until it touches the orbit of the satellite and then I've placed my maneuver node and I'm just doing the burn from there so the next time I come around to that point I will be having an encounter with the satellite hopefully this first half of the mission is pretty much the same as docking although I don't intend to mate with the target I intend to destroy it this is the only really important maneuver to make sure you circularize your orbit so you are not drifting away from the target and here we are target acquired okay so I need to make sure my prograde marker is over the target I'm sure you guys know how to do this right okay initiating attack run in we go I'm gonna come in quite fast get nice and close and deliver these missiles and hopefully try and get a kill so I'm gonna do this from the cockpit because it's easier to aim and that little nav ball makes a perfect targeting computer so I'm just making little corrections to make sure I'm staying bang on his bearing I'll try and pull out at the last minute. I'm just going to turn around here so my missiles are level with those sails to maximize the chance of a hit here. Because taking out those sails would be good enough for me. No power, no satellite. Okay, it's all down to this. Nice and aimed. Let's launch these missiles. Okay. And that's a hit. That looked pretty devastating. That looked pretty devastating. That's better than I expected. That is a hit. Look at all the bits flying off it. Excellent. Okay, I'm going to take a closer look. Let's look at a replay. So I'm coming in. There's the missiles launched. Wow, look at that explosion. That has got to be a kill. I can't see that satellite working after this, but let's inspect it. It looks like we scored a hit on the aft RCS tank, and that's just blown and it's got rid of both the sails so it's got no maneuverability and no power that is a hit and that will teach them to not mess with spirit wolf we will take measures to maintain our product and the integrity of our company name so an immediate deorbital burn before anyone discovers what's happened out here I'm just skimming the atmosphere of Kerbin here so I can enter a decay in orbit because I want to land back at KSC like the brief describes and I'm not in the right position because it was in geosynchronous orbit so I'm just going around a few times decaying the orbit until I get an opportunity um, to land look at all that debris floating out there I have to clear all that up at some stage nearly home just one more pass I think through the atmosphere decaying this orbit until I can retro burn and try and land I can see KSC there so this is probably the pass in which I should do it it's not perfect it's going to take a little bit more fuel <laughs> than I needed but I do have a little bit to spare 
and then to land as long as I glide down most of the way so but I've got a bit closer and I realize now I'm going to overshoot as usual so I'm doing a very inefficient last minute burn here to just try and correct where I'm going to land I'm also off the ecliptic a bit having evaded that explosion in that attack run I've pushed myself off orbit a little bit um, but that will do I think it's a very high angled descent it's going to be quite hair raising I think luckily there's no um, re-entry physics as far as burning up is concerned because I think this is quite a candidate for disaster but we don't have that at the moment so that's okay I'm coming in very very fast I need to get my nose down because I'm going to overshoot going extremely fast so it's a bit twitchy on the wings but that should do it nose diving towards the ground pull up a little bit at the bottom not too hard at this rate because I'm likely to flip there you go we're gaining control air speeds down to a more manageable state and now let's try and land just ignited my little stabilizer jet underneath which will slow my descent a little bit, slow my forward momentum as I line up on the runway and try and get it as straight as possible I keep landing on the edge of the runway recently, I'm going to try and land more in the middle, I'm getting slightly better at these landings, these VTOL landings, it's a bit different to normal so that's nice and slow probably about time to ignite the rest, oh that was a bit much I always do that, but that's okay almost stop moving forward now just gently bring it down I've learned to do this a little bit more slowly than I was before and you can manage any drift if it comes about but this is looking okay almost down and touchdown best yet I think although sometimes more luck than judgment so mission complete Isprit manages to take down its first target on its first mission and land again with um, quite success so hopefully this will demonstrate to the world Spirit Wolf are more than capable of defending its assets um, hope you enjoyed and bye for now